if you spend some time on freezer burns Then you might stave off the stomach churns Rake's the frozen food master He's best bud to your taste buds Hi, welcome to Freezer Burns. I'm your host, Greg, the frozen food master. And you're joining me as I eat my way through the freezer aisle one box at a time. Today, I'm reviewing this. It is the Pierre drive through Spicy Chicken Sandwich. $1.99 for this sandwich. This is a thick sandwich from a brand I've never heard of. Pierre, I assume French, drive through Spicy Chicken. Spicy, breaded, boneless chicken breast patty on a corn-dusted bun. I love my buns corn-dusted, don't you? And only $2 for this. Now, the last time I reviewed something that looked like this, it was that amazing bacon cheeseburger from Kroger. I'm still thinking about that. And I know a lot of people, uh, a lot of you guys are commenting that uh, that one's good and there's other ones from Kroger as well. This is the same size box, thick. It includes the bun and I'm going to get this out of the box. I'm going to put it in the microwave. I'm going to tell you how it looks, how it smells, and I get this, all of it, down deep into my belly. Okay, I've taken this Pierre drive through spicy chicken sandwich out of the microwave. I reheated it, basically, in the microwave on, for 75 seconds on high. Here's how it looks. As you can see, it's got this, this corn dusted bun is nice and yellow, and uh, I guess that's good. I guess that's a nice, Nice. I mean, it's corn dusted. I'm not quite sure what corn dusted really brings to the table. But anyway, uh, and this spicy chicken patty kind of jets out. It's like a jetty right outside uh, from the circle bun. And I kind of dig that because it kind of feels like I'm getting something extra. You know what I mean? Like Pierre, he's, he's like, I'm going to hook you up with a, chick a piece of chicken that's just more than the bun. You know how like when you have a burger uh, at a fast food joint and the bun, the burger is sticking outside the bun, you're like, that is some bonus burger or bonus chicken. That's what we got going on here. Now, on the box though, it says spicy breaded chicken, the perfect blend of boneless chicken breasts and seasonings that will spice up your day. So that's a bold statement because my day is already naturally spicy. This is going to spice up my day. It better be spicy. I'm not talking like, oh, like standard frozen food where it's like, oh yeah, that's spicy and, I'm, and I take a bite out of it. I'm like, there's barely a tingle on my tongue. I'm talking spicy like Chick-fil-A spicy chicken, all right? I want spice, that's what I'm hoping to get out of this. The other thing is on the other side it says, hearth baked corn dusted buns that taste like they came right out of the oven. Soft and delicious every time. That is a, that's a great copyright going on. Okay. So there's my bonus chicken sticking out of there. We got this nice yellowish bun. Now on the bottom of the bun, it, it kind of um, looks buttered, but I think it's just kind of the chicken oil or the chicken grease or chicken juice soaking into the bun. Okay, enough of this talk. Let's get this in my belly. I'm waiting for the spice. Kind of spicy. Let me go for a second bite. Okay. First off, the bun it does taste like it came right out of the oven. I, I will give them props for that. It's hard to do a bun in the, out of the microwave and it not taste chewy or rubbery or, or tough. That bun's pretty good. Maybe it's the corn dustedness, corn dusted action. Maybe it's just the way it's made up. So I'll give them that. The chicken, you know, it said bo breaded boneless chicken breast patty. Uh, so I was expecting like a real legit piece of chicken. But now that I look in the ingredients, actually before I get to the ingredients, I will tell you that when I bit into it, it was one of those like, oh, it's, it's like the essence of chicken, but then it's kind of watery and kind of like my, my teeth go through it and it just feels like it's not a real piece of chicken. I've been duped. Sure enough, I look in the ingredients, it says fully cooked breaded spicy chicken breast patty, wait for it, with rib meat. And that's exactly what it tastes like. Now, 
So the consistency, the texture of the chicken is not your good chicken, it's your $1.99 chicken. The bun is good, the spiciness factor, it is a hint of spiciness. My wife doesn't like spicy at all. She would be like, huh, that's interesting, is it a little spicy? For me, I'm like, what, what's going on? I'm gonna pour some kakalaki sauce on this when I turn the camera off. Given all that, the Pierre drive through Spicy Chicken Sandwich, $1.99 for this sandwich. Easy to prepare in the microwave, okay quality. It's $1.99 quality. If I'm comparing it to other chicken sandwiches, it's, I mean, you're better off going to a fast food joint for, uh, for that price. I will give this a three out of five star rating. Question of the day. Tell me about the spiciest thing you've ever eaten. And, and don't tell me, don't leave in the comment section like, oh, I don't eat spicy. Even if you don't eat spicy, there's some time when you're like, I didn't realize that was spicy. And oh my God, I'm like, ah, my mouth is on fire. Tell me about your spiciest thing that you've ever eaten. Hopefully we get some of you like super hardcore spicy people that are like, oh man, I go for the wings and I go for the, the wings where I have to sign a waiver. If that's you, leave it in the comment section. As always, I'm your host, Greg, the Frozen Food Master. This has been another review of Freezer Burns. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.